Welcome to the Polish Museum of Chicago. Why don't we take a look at some of the artifacts which make the Polish Museum of America in Chicago a unique place. The room we're in is called the King's Room. Uh, it represents the Polish monarchy that ruled Poland from 966 when Poland accepted Christianity from Rome through uh, 1795 when Poland was dismembered, disappeared off the face of Europe. Uh, probably one of the more successful uh, elected monarchs was King Sobieski, who as a military leader uh, was elected uh, because Poland needed a strong and experienced commander to lead her at the times of the wars with the uh, Ottoman Empire. The armor we're looking at comes from the uh, 1500s to the early 1700s. It's called the winged hussar armor for the obvious reason of these wings that were attached to the, uh, to the rider. The enemies of the Poles on the eastern borderlands, the Turks and the Tartars, uh, the Tartars used to employ a lasso to pull the armored knight off of his horse. One of the theories is that these wings were actually frames to thwart the lasso so it would get caught up here, not around the knight's neck or chest. Later on, these feathers, usually turkey or eagle feathers, were added on to make the knight look more imposing. And it was these riders, these uh, Polish cavalrymen, that helped win the uh, victory at uh, Vienna in 1683.